And hello, yes, you're listening to The Wild Show with me, Chris Norton, and Jonathan Daly. Oi! And <laughs> RJD. <laughs> and Will. It's Seven, William. Seven, eight, nine, GB. William, William. <laughs> Chris, we've all gone social media crazy. Yeah, okay. yeah. You've got to remember the 789 GB. You've got to remember my number as well, Chris. But I tried your uh, your email address is Jeff Will Pollard. That's true. So Well it depends on what which which day of the week it is. Seven eight nine. <laughs> 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 Jason has already started. He's sending you messages. Yeah, he is. I think I have to explain to the listeners <laughs> that text messages have now taken over radio and it doesn't work very well on FM. No. Um, so he sent me two pictures already. So, J.D., I just want to point out you're hardly... No pointing in the studio. You're hardly a metre from me. <laughs> so don't you think conversation would be more helpful? And I like that picture, J.D., I think. <laughs> I like that one. Yeah. Ah, yeah, yes. that, yeah, that's a nice one. <laughs> well, would one of you be capable of sending these pictures to Facebook, where uh, our listeners could see what was going on? <laughs> JD, do can. they want to know what's happening? Well, I don't know. Somebody must be listening to the radio, thinking this is very odd. <laughs> <laughs> and that, that's the other one he said. All oh, right, so we've got a photo of Chris and a photo of JD. Yeah. Which for both of them is very interesting. And our listeners might be a bit interested. <laughs> if only they could see them. Yeah, well, I guess it will be on Facebook. The photo of me will be on Facebook soon. Uh, this is great radio, isn't it? I know. It's where we're all heading. Yeah. Radio will disappear if it goes on like this. Yeah. <laughs> Me and JD are not responsible for killing radio. No, you are too. Well, no, but do you think every radio studio is going to end up with people staring into their phones, sending <laughs> photographs to each other when they could be pressing a button and playing some music? Because if, if that is what happens, it's not actually um, uh, an off-com decision to turn off FM, is it? It's just a, a creeping paralysis through culture taking over. I wouldn't blame the listeners for trying to find something else going on. They could take photographs of each other, send them all over the place. Yeah, I can't remember what my profile picture is on Facebook, so I've got to read now. Oh, how to upload it. Uh, Could I say that Phonic FM has also got a social media profile somewhere? I think if you search for Phonic FM, all one word, on Twitter, you will find something. So if the FM signal does go a little bit lackadaisical, you could probably find some other show that has uploaded a copy of it. Well, in fact, we do that as well. You can go to Spreaker, you can find a previous show. Access or Aerial. Yeah, that's probably got some music in it. OK, well, as you requested, I've uploaded the photo of me. I can even upload the one of JD as well. Well, this is all good. But I'm not going to put Radio Pro in his. Joe Radio Dan Pro? Where did that come from? That's what I called myself. <laughs> oh, I see. Radio Pro. So yeah. where in the manual does it talk about eight minutes of silence or nonsense? 
as a way of keeping the listeners interested. Oh, they're done. Okay. Um, let's hear... Let's hear some music because that's why everyone listens to the radio. So this shall be Motorhead with Ace of Spades. <laughs> 